I'm definitely not the only person to go fishing around here. See? Found the bait casting rod, or a casting rod anyway. Brand new, still got the barcode on it. Zebco Slingshot. Wonder if I can find the rest of it around here somewhere. just got some stuff in the mail here uh, for a comparison this is that broken one I found it a while back I just put one hook on it to fix it uh, I never put the second hook on it because they were getting tangled up I didn't have one small enough uh, the the bill broke off but it was working pretty well as a comparison for the ones that I just got they're about the same size this one's a little bit bigger I've got I got six of these for about four dollars on eBay from China see it's pretty close to the same size same shape uh, got a couple different colors patterns should work pretty well and uh, here for a size comparison here's a quarter so you can see they're pretty small those this one is a uh, a legitimate one that you would buy at like Academy or Walmart for about five dollars. I think they call them like mini pond minnows or something like that. Uh, I also got another set of uh, crankbaits. There was ten of them for about six dollars. And as you can see, these are much smaller. I got ten of these, all of them. Each one with a different color and pattern. Got a whole bunch of them sitting here in plastic bags. So I'm going to go try these out and see if these work, uh, see how well they work. And I'm sure these will get eaten up by the panfish around there, the sunfish and all that. So uh, see if I can catch anything decent with them. Alright, I tied on uh, one that's got a red head, white body, and a little bit of yellow down the back. This is one of the bigger ones. get some distance on it. There's a lot of movement even when you do it slowly. Another little... It's got a little bit of weight to him. Alright, these are literally half the size of the other crankbaits but the hooks on them are are bigger I want to focus and the bill on them's a lot smaller it's a square bill uh, this one's a bluegill pattern colors a little bit off but I'll try it out all right now I'm moving on to the tiniest crankbait I've ever seen and I might not it's probably gonna be more like a fly lure than anything else I don't know if I'm gonna be able to cast it out Doesn't quite want to cast out all the way. Oh, come on. Fucking plants. Oh, oh, I 
see a good sized one. Right down on the edge of the water here. Right up there at the edge of that driftwood. Oh, that was quick. As soon as I hit the water, I got a little bluegill. <laughs> I was trying to get a backlash out of my reel, and he took off with it. Not the one I was trying to catch. There was a pretty good sized bass down there, too, but I got this one instead. God damn fucking mosquitoes, not right now. Oh my god, I had him. Did not set the hook. He was on it. That was the big one. Got him that time. Not a big one, but bigger than other fish I caught today. Just my... Got a, got a little bit of a gut on him. And he took my, my yum dinger. Good thing those things are cheap. Not a very big one, not a keeper. Yeah. But it's a bass. the one I wanted. I might keep throwing down there, see if there's any more. Oh. That sucks. I need to go buy more yum dingers now. <laughs> one more one worm, one fish. He swallowed it or what, but it was gone. I got two left in the package after this. Hey, yeah, I can record while I'm charging. I just hope my charging cable doesn't get stuck on anything here. This thing's backlashing worse than a fucking bait cast. Is. There, a little bass. Stop shaking, I don't want to lose my worm. This one's got a different color than the rest of them. Get a picture of this worm on him. Sure 